Searching for Giants, episode one. If you guys checked out the last video, I was saying we're releasing a new series onto the channel. We've been doing Fishing for Giants for a minute now. This is a new series called Searching for Giants. But first of all, if you guys are new to the channel, I'm Noah. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and also turn on post notifications. We upload three bangers every single week, and that is an absolute fact. And if you guys have been enjoying the content recently, be sure to hit that like button. But Searching for Giants, episode one. First video ever for this series and what is searching for giants so searching for giants is where we are going to new ponds new bank fishing spots that we've never been to before and we're gonna be trying to locate the big fish so we have never been to any of these spots we're just trying to experiment with new places it's gonna keep it very interesting and relatable for you guys that are trying to find new ponds and obviously catch big fish so that is the basis of this new series but without further ado we're gonna go ahead and get on the road and get to our first location baby well, this is the first cast today. We're gonna start off with this little booyah trap. It's been a good bait recently. Never been here, first time. I don't even know if there's fish in here, but we we're gonna find out this morning, and hopefully we're gonna find some big old bass. I am gonna give this fish out a try just to see if I can actually throw this here. See if there's too much stuff on the bottom or not. I want to test that out before I bring this pole all the way around the pond with me. I feel like there's a lot of leaves on the bottom, so I want to test that out before I just drag this thing along. I'd rather cover water with one rod than I have to bring both of them. Looks like there should be a fish back in this little corner. I don't even know if there's fish in this pond. That's my biggest thing. That's one thing about fishing new places is you just don't know. So you get that bite just like that i got him oh my gosh guys he's small <laughs> he's running circles okay all right i will take that you know what we are like a few minutes in today at a new pond i've never been to just caught probably the smallest bass i've caught in weeks but guess what that shows that there's fish in here that's the first thing and two that gets the monkey off her back First to try to catch some giants today. I caught it on this old booyah right here. Let's see if we can duplicate that, but try to catch a giant. There he is. Oh, that's a better one. All right, nothing big. We still, we still weaving through the small guys. That's our second fish pretty quick. Look at the color on these fish. Very, very light. I'm gonna just about to start covering water with this trap. Second fish. We're catching the small ones, guys, but this is the point of this series, is the weave through the small ones, try to find the giants at these new ponds. Looks like there should be some more stacked up in this back corner. I like how this narrows, narrows down back here. Yep, got another one. Next cast. Oh, looks a little better. We're upgrading every time. About the same size, okay. Guys, we are on them, we are on them. We aren't on the big ones, but that was two casts in a row. And this little neck down back here, that's good because I've seen a few other places around here. They're similar, maybe this little pattern we can run into is where these ponds neck down in these little shallow corners. Third fish on the old trap, another baby. We are figuring something out and I like it. I like how quick this is happening. All right. I'm liking this so far. I'm really liking this. They're not big, but we're, we're figuring them out. That's the point. We've got two and two casts. Should be another one sitting up in there. Money. Oh yeah, spooked one. Oh my gosh. Oh God. Same size. They are eating this crankbait, guys. 
We've caught four fish and three of them have been the last five casts. We were figuring them out. They're eating this crankbait and this looks like we got a good little morning bite going. Now we just got to try to upgrade and we're probably going to fish here a little bit longer. We might need to go to another spot. I don't know if it's just because we're fishing in this corner or this pond might just have, you know, dinks like this, but at least we're finding the fish and figuring out what they want. One thing to think about guys, when you get an opportunity like this where you're parallel with the bank, the beam of cast just like that so you're covering you know in that hot spot where those fish just like that that's a better one he's running at me oh yeah that's a better one guys this is the best one today we are freaking smacking them about the same size he felt better he's just running at me there we go another fish just like i was talking about right here they're parallel with this bank i know there's gonna be more sitting up there we're gonna have to give that a try too but we are just smoking them. This is not the size, but I am having fun right now. This is, <laughs> we've caught like five or six fish within 10 minutes. Oh my God, he slapped the heck out of me. I can't tell if he's big or not. God, he stopped me cold turkey, he baby. All right, thank you. I didn't even want to catch you. He sure slapped it. He's over on that side. He's out more in the middle. Golly, guys, next, next cast. They're stacked right out of there. Dink City, we are freaking on them. Oh yeah, we're necking down back in this corner just how that other one was. Start whacking them. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Oh man, that's two pounder. Oh yeah, <laughs> yes, and he choked it look at that guys that is the best fish today solid two pounder and that trap is in the back of his throat oh man that is awesome this is why we are filming this series upgrading and that that is a quality fish that is a good good start right there i had to start bringing my pliers with me because of these fish sometimes get aggressive man that is a nice fish right there about a pound and three quarters i want to say quite two but he's pushing it that is a good start for the dinks that we were just catching. Maybe we'll find some bigger ones in this back corner. All right, that is, that's it guys. This, look at that little fat tummy on them. This is our start to our upgrade. Oh, there we go. Let's go hit that like button, baby. What an amazing start to the morning. So that is the first pond. I think that's a success, guys. We haven't caught any big ones. We caught one two pounder. Okay, but we've caught 10 fish in like the matter of, I don't even know how long it's been. It's probably been like 30 minutes. Already caught 10, never been in this place before in my life. We're about to go try a new one. I feel like there's just a lot of small ones in that one. I'm sure there are some big ones, but for us to catch 10, not get one that's like pretty solid, I think we need to keep covering water and try some new spots. So that's what we're about to do. We're gonna throw the rods in the car and hunt for a new one. Oh man. Oh gosh, this one looks really good. I'll have to put my sunglasses on. God, it's got some grass in here. Throw it right on the edge of this grass. Oh God, I got him right away. Not a bad one, it's probably the second biggest today. Oh yeah, look at him tugging. Yeah, let's go. Boom, just like what I was saying, around the edge of that grass. We got one right away. Nothing big, but he's probably about the second biggest today. He's kind of similar to those ones we were catching at the beginning. Around the edge of this grass, right where he should have been. We're gonna make another cast, I know there's more than one there. This pond looks a lot better. Yeah, this looks like I'm about to fall in. Oh my God. Yes, I literally almost just fell in. But does that matter, guys? Does that matter when you're catching fish? Does it matter if you're about to fall in, if you're catching fish? This is just it. They're eating this trap. I found exactly what they wanted. I just need to find the giants, but the quality here is bigger. They're like thicker, I can tell you that. Look at the stomach on them. And that is like three cast already. Already caught two. We are finding the bigger fish. I'm just waiting on that four plus. Oh no! He saw me. Ah, uh, I don't know if the GoPro caught that. I got him. Why did you come back for that? You literally saw me. And you're a baby. We don't want 
the babies. This is searching for giants, not searching for Twinkie bass. There he is. That's a bigger one. At least he feels, oh yeah. Oh, what? Not bad, but why do you feel so big? Why did you feel so big? Maybe this is one of those ponds where you catch a fish and they just fight so hard, because I have seen that. I really thought I had a solid three pounder right there. I felt like he was tugging pretty hard, but we're still finding new spots, still finding new fish. But I like this. This is more of a lake. They're really big. Yep. Oh, man. These fish must fight hard in here unless he's good. Oh, yeah, this is a better one. It has to be. Holy crap. Oh, I got him hooked under the mouth. He's like a two-pounder. There we go. He ain't, he ain't quite that big. I have him hooked in the side of the face. He's tugging. These fish fight hard out here. He slapped at that trap. Look at that. That's a thicker fish. God. I'll take you, buddy. Thank you for biting. You felt big, though. You and your little friend over here. You guys have been eating good or something. It's like fish 15. Oh, guys, my GoPro wasn't running. Alan just met up with me. Is he big? Oh my God, dude. All right, all right. Oh, he's a good one, bro. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get you. All right, that's my fish right there, about two pounds. Oh my God. Yeah! <laughs> there we Look go. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Dude, you just came. This is like it's Alan's like first third cast. cast or something like that. Guys, I guess we need Alan on certain <laughs> Oh my god. Dude, he literally just came out here. Like, I haven't even had time to film him. My GoPro died, and the words that came out of my mouth is, we're about to catch him. <laughs> and literally, I hooked one right when it died, and he's caught like a solid oh four god. and a half. Oh, well, guys. Hey, Dude. look how stubby is Bro, he, that's bro. a good fish. <laughs> Searching for giants, we're finding them, baby. Just gotta call Alan Bob and get him to hook him. <laughs> oh my god, that's so insane. Let me, let me show you guys what's kind of happening. There's a little bit of wind out here. It's pushing right up in this corner. And those fish are just stacked out feeding. And that's when you catch a solid four and a half pounder. Look, I wanna see, look how I need to see his gut. And you guys are gonna kill me on this one. You guys have been saying to get a scale. I bought a scale and I left it at my freaking house this morning. And I don't have too much time, so I wasn't gonna turn around as a bunch of traffic. But solid fish right there. Let's get a release on them. All right, Alan Bob. <laughs> says, hey, Lily, boy, my third cast or something out here. And it's on his brand new Concept Z2. He oh, just yeah. got that. I literally just set it up for him before that. All right, bro. That's that is solid. Is. Freaking ah. giant. Searching for giants. I'm excited for this series. I know there's more out there. We doubled up right there. Of course, my GoPro wasn't running. I know. Right? Dude, freaking sweet. You got one? Is he big? Is he really? Oh my god! <laughs> Look at him choke it, dude. The natural color. I think it's that natural. It's solid too. Chokes it, bro. What the heck? I think it's the natural color. This water's a little bit more clean, guys. The other ponds were a little dirty, and then they both have that natural. I still have my red on. I'm just using that, and then gets a good one like that. That's a decent fish. Yeah, there you go, good job. Oh, that has money with this wind. Right there, right at the bank. I gotta get Alan Bob on some more fish because I keep catching the dinks. Alan's gotta catch another four. God, hey. I don't know if he's big or not. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Look at that one. Yes, sir. There we go. Oh. <laughs> there we go, people. Been a minute since we had a bite right here. 
first fish in this new little spot that we came to. That's a long, dude, look how long he is. That's a long fish, solid 16 and a half inches right there. Let's get back in the water. That's my best one today. I've had I've had another two pounder, but that's, that's a little over two. Oh gosh. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Alan's second fish. Dude, look at his skinny body. Oh my god. He's got a big head. He literally has like a three pound head and <laughs> tiny body. It's the skinniest fish I've ever seen. I know. <laughs> I know. That's so stupid. Nice job, Bob. Alan's got two fish today, two pretty decent ones. Good job, bro. Good job. There he is. Yeah, that's a good one, bro. Oh, man. There we go, guys. It's been a second since I've had a little bite. That's a quality two pounder. This one's thick. Not like that one Alan just caught. It was kind of skinny. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that fat stomach on him. That's awesome. Solid two pounder. That is a fat bass. God. That's so much fun. That is going to conclude Searching for Giants episode one, baby. If you guys are new to the channel and you have not hit that subscribe button yet, be sure to click that. Also hit post notifications, turn those on. We post three bangers every single week. If you guys are enjoying the new videos, be sure to hit that like button. This is a brand new series I'm bringing onto the channel. Super excited to see what's in store for this new series. We are still gonna be running Fishing for Giants, but we're gonna be mixturing you know, that series with this one as well. I feel like this one's just a lot more unique. So we're hitting new spots, it's more real. I know you guys are like on the hunt for new fishing spots as well, and you guys are trying to catch a big fish. So I feel like it's really relatable for you bank fishermen that are going out there trying to catch the big ones and trying to find new spots to obviously fish at. But overall, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Be sure to hit that like button. And until next time, keep catching fish, baby. Try it.